Hello, my name is Pam Bador, and I am a recent graduate from O'Hare University's Bachelor of Science program in oral health promotions. I was a dental hygienist for over 30 years. I now work in dental sales with oral science here in Canada. And I've long known that the amount of time spent brushing is a key factor in the removal of dental plaque. As a dental practitioner, it was apparent that my patients felt they were brushing longer than they actually were. And when asked to time themselves, they were shocked at how long two minutes actually took with a toothbrush in their mouths. I struggled finding ways to inspire them to spend that extra time each day in order to effectively remove dental plaque. From my training with the CurePROC system with oral science, I began dry brushing with a soft toothbrush about one year ago and I was hooked. I felt my teeth were cleaner. I felt more methodical and more thorough with my brushing. And to me, this was a no brainer. It was easy and it was effective. So why wouldn't everyone brush this way? At every office meeting, I give each staff member a CurePROX toothbrush and I add the dry brushing instructions. It's always surprising to me that rarely has anyone ever heard of dry brushing and rather, they often question me as though I've misspoken. The whole idea of not using toothpaste is so foreign to them and unappealing. However, when I go deeper into explaining the reasoning behind it, I can see it begins to make sense. But what is disappointing and confusing to me is that when I return for another meeting and give them another brush and ask how the dry brushing is going, almost all of them have either abandoned the idea or the practice or, or have never tried it. And the main reason was that they'd forgotten about it in the first place or they just lapsed back into their old habits using toothpaste. So this led me to my action research question. If I can inspire people to dry brush for two weeks and have them assess their plaque removal with disclosing tablets, will they notice enough of an improvement in their oral hygiene to adopt it as a permanent practice? So I interviewed five participants after the project and all of them admitted that their teeth felt cleaner. They were pleased with the result. They did brush with toothpaste after dry brushing, but automatically we have them brushing twice as long. So they all felt that it was a, a practice that they would be able to maintain moving forward. And the knowledge that I've gained, it's extremely helpful to me moving forward in my career in dental sales because it, support, it supports my suggestion to dental professionals that this is a game changer. Um, I'll feel more confident that my recommendation to them is validated both from my own research and from the research of others that I've been reading. And hopefully that confidence will inspire my customers to adopt, adopt dry brushing and love it as much as I do. My work mantra is do your best, learn more and do better. And O'Hare University and my action research project has supported me in doing just that. Thank you.